Welcome back, my YouTube nuts, and today we're just doing a real quick follow-up video on the Cartoon Classics Collection. I've already done a Volume 1, where I showed off most of what I got, and I did a quick Volume 2, so this is going to be a real quick Volume 3, just showing you the recent pickups that I've made. If the camera will focus. There we go. So first off, we're going to start off with Monster Force, Volume 1. This is probably my favorite pickup that I've gotten recently. Uh, this is, I want to say, about... Got 13 episodes. It says the runtime is 2 hours and 53 minutes. I really don't have much of a memory or recollection of this cartoon at all. Man, this camera won't focus for shit. But yeah, this is a, a true score, and this is a real delight for horror fans. If you get the chance to ever pick this up or even just watch it on YouTube, it's very cool. Very, very cool stuff. Just that back alone is awesome. So yeah, this was a super score. The next one was uh, one of the more inevitable ones that I've been putting off, but I got it super cheap, was the Thundercats Season 1, Part 1. I told you all I want to get is like the first couple of episodes of a lot of these shows. If I have to get a complete series set, then that's what I'll do. But in this case, like with Transformers and G.I. Joe and Thundercats, shows that went on for years and years and years, I don't want to get all those episodes. It's just too damn much. Just give me the pilot episode and the first couple episodes, and I'm good to go. Uh, there's actually a previous one that came out of this. Uh, it was like a, it was like real fat box where it just showed Lionel's eyes and it had a lenticular cover. Well, again, I'm all about consolidation, and I picked the slim set. It's exactly the same discs. I just wanted the slimmer set so it wouldn't take up as much room on my shelf. Thundercats is probably definitely in my top five favorite cartoons of all time, and it is definitely my favorite cartoon intro of all time. So yeah. Thundercats. Next one I picked up was The Adventures of Tintin, Season 1. I can't remember what channel this was on when it aired. I want to say it was on HBO or something, but yeah. I, for some reason, I was just really drawn to getting this. I know this isn't really, like, dark or action, but I just absolutely had to have it. There's Captain right there. It's a very, very, very plain set. I mean, there's nothing. It's funny because they put it in a clear case, but there's absolutely no interior art whatsoever. Just blue. That's it. So, yeah. That's the Adventures of Tintin. And the next one I picked up, I wanted to get mostly due to its rareness, was the, uh, the Archie show. This is another one where I have absolutely no memory of this. I'm not even sure when it aired. I want to say maybe late 60s, early 70s, because I popped it in and it was not at all what I was expecting. I was expecting like a lot of like high school drama and stuff like that and who likes who and all that with teachers and homework and all that. And it's not that at all. It's basically just, you know, them hanging out and having fun and yeah, that's about it. This is, uh, I, want, I want to say this is uh, the whole series. It's uh, 10 episodes. So yeah, this is the Archies. And my last pickup was probably the most rare, uh, and next to Monster Force, this is the one I'm most happy to have had added to my collection, and that is the Garbage Pail Kids, the complete series. And this is all 13 episodes, and this is another one of those where I have absolutely no memory of watching this ever when I was a kid. And the reason why is because it says in the back here that it was supposed to air in 1986 or 1989, and they were unaired and unseen. They never aired this show. So, uh, basically, yeah, this is a cartoon show that never saw the light of day. So I was very happy to pick this up. It's a two-disc set. Got some nice art there on the discs. So, yeah, this has been my Cartoon Classics Update Part 3. I'll try to keep you updated with the cartoons as I get them. Uh, if you like what you saw, hit the subscribe button. And as always, thank you for watching, my YouTube friends.